guys welcome back to New Zealand now today for the last few days I've been at this cricket tournament in Christchurch it's going okay the boys are doing well we've had one loss one draw sorry two losses one draw and a couple of wins uh, it's a bit of a round robin at the minute and then it gets to the quarterfinals and then final so uh, the boys are tracking well for the uh, for the semi-finals but we'll see how they go anyway uh, I thought I've not had a chance to get out and do. I've been out and done some photographs, but I've not had a chance to do much vlogging. So I thought I'd give you a bit of a rundown and show you a little bit of footage of what I've been up to. The last vlog I finished with the sun set at Kaikoura. I got up the next morning, went down to the beach there, and shot sunrise, and it was it was a beautiful morning. It's absolutely stunning, actually. Got some nice photographs from there, quite happy with them. From there I went into Kaikoura itself, had a bit of a breakfast and a coffee. And then I went to the beachfront in Kaikoura, in Kaikoura Township itself. Now that was, that was stunning with these snow covered mountains, it was absolutely spectacular. But I arrived there sort of midday, harsh light. I got a couple of photographs, long exposures. Nothing spectacular, but I just think it uh, it's worth posting. I'll post it here. I converted it to black and white, actually. I quite like that. Uh, from there, I got on the road and I drove down to Christchurch, which is a lovely drive, tremendous drive. I arrived at Christchurch, went straight into the opening ceremony of the uh, the tournament's opening ceremony, which was very good. Uh, then stuck around for one of the matches, and then the next morning, there's a lot of and thens going on. I can see me editing all of this and then like out. Anyway, the next morning I got up early doors and I drove into Christchurch Central. I got an idea that I wanted to photograph the Christchurch Cathedral because back in 2011 and previous to that 2010 there was a couple of massive earthquakes that absolutely shook the city to its core. It really absolutely devastated the place. A large number of fatalities, an even larger number of casualties and there's they were the two big quakes, the second one costing all the lives. Uh, but the aftershocks, I mean, we were, we're talking thousands upon thousands of aftershocks that went on for a couple of years at least. I mean, that's, I still think we're having aftershocks now. It was just absolutely, it, it was on a scale which is mind boggling, it really is. Uh, so on, there's a massive rebuild going in, it's going to be the newest city in the world, it's going to be absolutely, it's going to be state of the art when it's finished. But I want to go into town and just get a couple of photographs of the cathedral because the cathedral at the minute is still they're still debating whether or not to demolish or rebuild or who knows who knows what's going on. I don't know what stage it's at. Anyway, so I went in there, got a few shots of uh, Christchurch CBD at sunrise. Back to the tournament, shot some more crickets. There's been a lot of cricket to shoot, uh, and then I had a little bit of an accident where I was checking my uh, my Nikon D3S. With the 80 to 200 lens on, and unfortunately, give it a little bit of a drop. Not from a great height, but <laughs> great enough. Great enough to cost me a $1,300 repair bill, uh, which is a bit of a sinker. The contacts between the camera and the lens are shot. Needs a new part bringing in from Singapore, I believe. So it's going to be about three weeks, which is a bit of a kick in the nuts. But uh, keep smiling. Shit happens. Uh, so. To take the camera into the repair centre, a Nikon, uh, Nikon authorised repair centre in New Brighton, Christchurch. So I drove it in and I thought, well, I'm here, I'll just have a bit of a look around New Brighton because I know there's a pier there. So I had a stroll along the pier, that's quite, quite a nice place. I got a few long exposure shots, again, middle of the day stuff, uh, but it's, it, it worked out okay. And then just along the beach, there's a, there's a yacht that sort of uh, came in a couple of weeks ago. And apparently the uh, the pilot is it the pilot the sailor the yachtsman he he apparently ran out of gas on the way from from Wellington and uh, he, he ran aground unfortunately so the the boats unfortunately for him the boats there and it's toast uh, really nice for me and other photographers is it's a bit of a draw card and people are going down there and it does make some cracking shots so I was quite pleased with some of them photographs. Uh, Full day's cricket today. The boys have got off to a cracking start today. They've just beaten South Africa. 
close game, 118, 117, cracking game. Uh, they've got two more matches today, Singapore, which is the next game. Uh, they should get through that one quite comfortably. And then the, the next game is against England, the mother country, the mighty, mighty England. Uh, I hope we beat them, uh, just for my boys' sake. We played them the other day and uh, we drew 103 all. Now, apparently, that was a great performance by them and they really celebrated that draw in fine style. We're good on them. Uh, I appreciate the passion, it was fantastic. Uh, but hopefully, they won't be celebrating anything like as vigorously today. So, guys, listen, that's about it. It's a bit of a mishmash of just all sorts of crap, what I've been doing the last few days. Uh, I hope you get some interest out of it. Uh, if not, no worries. You know where the thumbs down button is. Uh, please don't. Anyway, uh, so tomorrow there's a day off the tournament. That's Wednesday. There's a day off the tournament. So the boys have got a rest day. So I'm going to get in the van and I'm going to bugger off to a little place called Akaroa on the Banks Peninsula near Christchurch. And apparently that's going to be quite a nice little place. So I'll get a few photographs and a bit of video from that and I'll try and shoot a, a dedicated vlog from that area. Alright guys, so from now, from uh, a stinking hot Christchurch, it's beautiful, I'm sat in the van here just to avoid the road noise because I'm parked on a bloody busy road opposite the, uh, the stadium, uh, so I hope you're getting a bit of audio out of this. Anyway, from uh, a stinking hot New Zealand, for now, kakiteano, catch you later.